Alright guys, he's finally here. You know Rain is my favorite character, it's one of my favorite characters in Mortal Kombat Mobile, Classic Rain being the absolute favorite. And now we have Adenian Blood Rain, uh, who has been added to the game, part of the Adenian Blood team. We only have Kitana and Rain so far. And they decided to release a guaranteed pack. So in a way, you spend $30, you're going to get a guaranteed um, Adenian Blood Rain, you're going to get two diamonds, Two golds and one rare thunder blade uh, equipment card it's not really a big deal but after all if we compare this offer to all other offers for the past two years that's incredible because before that we never got a, a character guaranteed not only that but you have to gamble paying the same price you pay for diamonds for any of the new gold so it was horrible but now we have a reasonable price when i say reasonable i mean in the mobile gaming world because for certain people it's going to be absolutely unreasonable to spend 30 dollars to get one copy of a character uh if we compare this to for instance let's compare the purchasing one copy of edenian blood train for 30 dollars to uh, buying the entire Baldur's gate 3 game for let's say 50 dollars so just buy uh you just spend 50 dollars and buy the entire game versus spending 30 dollars and get a small portion this tiny portion of the game so um yeah Two concepts completely different, but I have to admit that this is a um, step into the right direction. So I'm going to purchase that pack, I'm going to play with Rain. Uh, so hopefully he's going to be a great card. See you in a second. Alright, so payment successful. And when it comes to diamonds, I will most probably get two sellbacks because I just don't have four diamonds maxed out. But this is going to be the perfect opening if I get one combat movie, classic movie, Sonia. Because that's the only diamond that I don't have on this account. That's my maxed out account. Yeah, almost maxed out. Oh, that's cool already. So I got a copy of Pyroman Satania. Cool, that's pretty cool. What else do I get? Just imagine if I get another goal that I don't have maxed out. That's going to be crazy. So far, so good. We have rain. Okay, we expected to get rain. Oh my god, look at his passive. It reads for like 10 seconds. Anyways, we continue. Ah, uh, classic Ermac. You cannot be like super lucky, right? Everything has its... Oh, I'm killable looking! That's crazy! Even though I have him maxed out on the account, but still, that was crazy lucky. And the last diamond is Strike Force Cassie. So, yeah, as I expected, I got two um, diamonds that I sold out. That I. I cannot really say that I sold them out. I, they were just sellbacks, right? Uh, I got uh, two golds that I don't have maxed out. One of them, I didn't uh, Blood Rain, which is all I need to do. Now. All I wanted to do at this point, I won't be playing a lot with him because uh, I don't have any experience with this guy, but definitely I want to do something and it is to check his passive. Uh, and uh, also I want to do this in the process, I want to max him out. He looks pretty good, I have to admit. Probably the best looking rain out of all of them. He looks really, really great. I also want to check his uh, victory stances. Wow, he's super cool. Okay, max out his special too. Now, max out his special 3 or X-Ray, okay. And now what I have to do is, basically I'm done. Yeah, I have to read the passive. Adenian Blood Rain gains Tidal Might over time for every opponent affected by Soaked. Okay, so we need to make sure that they're Soaked. Uh, I wonder whether he has to apply the Soak. Tidal Might empowers his special attacks and deals additional damage by Lightning. A rain can use his extra attack low tide to apply fear and soak for 20 seconds. Okay, uh, so it's guaranteed soak. That's pretty cool. He can also apply soak for seven seconds on one of his basic combos. That's even better. Low tide has an eight seconds cooldown. So basically, this is actually the best guy to do soak, right? Because he can apply soak on combo, and he can apply soak on his a specific um, a specific skill, which is actually not one of his three skills, but something extra. So in a way, it's super easy to team soak, I guess. I guess. Uh, Rain assists his outward teammates with lightning strike on their combo enders. Uh, so this means that he will... Yeah, the problem is that, for instance, Classic Rain doesn't really use a lot of combo enders. However, I wonder whether this is going to be great with this Rain. For each Daniel teammate, low tide cooldown is reduced by 1 second. So if there are 3 teammates, it's going to be reduced to 5 or to 4 seconds. That's something that I need to check. Anyways, he looks pretty great and uh, his passive uh, looks on first glance pretty nice. I'm not going to lie. So, uh, 
Okay, I forgot that I need to also to check his victory stances. Let me see the last one. Flawless Prince. Ah, that's cool. That is so cool. Okay, that's awesome. That's seriously the best rain victory stance ever. So I already like this guy. I already like this guy. All right, so uh, let's try him out. I will give him some gear. I mean, anything. At this point, I just want to get a feeling of how this guy plays. Uh, and after that, I'm going to release a separate video where I'll be uh, trying hard and I'll be applying certain type of strategy or anything. Okay, let's test him out in a single fight without block breaker and to see uh, how uh, great he's going to be without uh, block breaker. That's going to be uh, important. All right, quick play. Should I should I actually try with two reigns or something? Because his synergy with uh, Daniel Vakitana doesn't seem to be great. It just reduces the cooldown by one second. So. Uh, it's not something incredible. So definitely what I would like to do is to get um, another rain in the fight. Classic rain. And yeah, now now we're talking, right? Okay, let's see. Let us see, guys. Let us see. We're fighting um, this particular team, which is not incredible. Actually, Combat of Johnny Cage is ascended to Fusion 1. So this should be a reasonably difficult fight. It's not going to be super difficult, but reasonably difficult. All right. Again, he looks awesome. The best looking rain in the game, hands down, in my opinion. All right. So I'm going to do this. Which is the combo that applies? It's not this one. Is this the combo that applies? Yeah, this is the combo that applies soak. Okay. Okay, I'm going to do this. Ooh. What happened? Why did I fear him? Like, seriously? What is that purple thing that... I don't understand. What's that purple thing? Let me read his passive again. Oh, Tidal Might empowers his special attacks and deals of damage by lightning. I understand now. Okay. Okay. Uh, did, where is the light? Okay, there's the lightning. Okay, cool. That's so cool. Oh my god, this guy can do so much thing only by virtue of his passive and how it works. So much better than... Oh my god, that's so cool. I really like this guy. I'm not going to lie. Definitely not going to spend uh, five hundred dollars to max him out because this is uh, on average. W oh, okay. <laughs> oh my God, his special twist. His special twist, pretty insane. I absolutely love it. Look at this. Oh my God, it's a block breaker. All right. So he's soaked. Cool. I absolutely love this character. I'm not going to lie. He's so much better than all the other combat movie characters combined. So I uh, expect a lot of videos from this guy because I have so much in my mind which uh, I cannot really do it now in this video. This video is going to be just first glance, but incredible, super awesome. So yeah, be ready for future content on Eden and Blood Rain. I have a lot of things in mind. See you next time, guys. Take care. Perfect.